Hello everybody, and welcome back to another episode. Welcome to Toro sitting. Well, about to. Is he going to sit? Is Toro going to sit down? Yes, Toro's going to sit down. Well, anybody, uh, uh well, uh, anyway, welcome back to another episode on the channel. Today we're going to be continuing off with our lost, um, our lost city build. Um, wow, what a shot. Ah, oh, right, well he's going to sleep. And in the last episode, we built the Colossal Colosseum. That's what I'm start calling it. Uh, while I have been away, um, I've just touched up on the area a little bit. I've done some more decoration here. I've added this. don't know why, but it, it just felt necessary. Um, over inside and outside, I added these... Uh, arches just going all the way across and it just kind of makes it feel more like a coliseum um, but yeah I also added this little bit so we can go down further into the park which we'll, we'll focus on a little later first I want to focus on this area down here to make it spruced up a bit uh, I did not do this on camera I've done this all off camera this part anyway and this was to um, this was a this story behind this, so this is all power stations, and this is like a story as if this used to be connected to all this up here, um, but then uh, it got infested with dinosaurs, which the dinosaur of choice has not been selected yet, so we still got t to do that, and we are going to do that in a bit later on in the episode, because I want to make it look a little nicer first uh so let me just add that as if the road never like cut off because you can't put it on the fences which kind of sucks can't lie but it don't matter so let's go ahead and do that and now let's put forests all around it so yeah as if it kind of like goes off and it used to like connect you but I got infested by dinosaurs, leaving this town completely powerless. Well, not actually, but yeah. Let's go ahead and do that. And then if I do it on the other side as well. Let's go ahead and do that. And we'll add dinosaurs in there. What we're going to add, I'm not 100% sure. So... First, let's decorate the area because that's my main focus. Let's get rid of the path. Alright, let's get rid of all of it apart from that apart from that piece. So let's go with just a bit of like a plaza around the viewing gallery. Um no. Now if I just go up by one, here we are, let me just kind of like in that. Hmm. Oh no, that bit of clipping there is just annoying. And that bit is, uh, let me just... Maybe there's a way just to go down, yeah. Oh no, that clipped again. Um. I need to go somewhere without it clipping. Come on. Oh, never mind. All ruined now because of that stupid bit of clipping. Let's just add a different type of path. Let's go with this one. We haven't really used this one. Okay, uh, there we go. <sighs> that looks terrible. But it can all be covered up with one simple thing. A fountain. 
There we are. Um, what else? What else? Let's go with maybe we can go with a planter here, maybe. Yeah. Sure, that works. Okay. Uh, add one more rock planter on each side. It's going down like that. And there we are. Let's go with something up here. Let's go with that. Fill this in. Like that. And there we are. Uh, we could probably put one of these in on each side. Not bad, can I? Yeah, I'm happy with that. Uh, now we can add some of these walls. Now we need. Hmm, what one? Uh. Yeah, why not? What the hell? Let me just. Alright, there we are. Alright, now if we connect the rest of it. The only thing is, we need to like do something to spruce up this path. No matter what I do with you, it'll just keep on clicking on it. Ooh. No, because that's fine. Alright. Great. Uh, let's add a... Wooden planter? Yeah, wooden planter suits. Uh, I guess I can add... That going all the way around. Just so it's covering the the white line on the path. There we are. Uh, just a bit more there. these on the end just to change it up a little there we are just a little I'm actually quite happy with that you know we just need some chairs if I can find the chairs they should be on here yeah yeah uh oh that's annoying that is very annoying so you know, mm, on. There we go. That's decent. Uh, it's just what I want to present this area with because I want this all to be shown, but yeah, it feels so empty, beer. So we can just go a bunch of shrubbery, maybe. Maybe that's the best way to go, just a bunch of shrubbery. I mean, that that's okay. So we can do that. Uh, let's just add a bunch of proper dense forest on the outside then because dense forest is usually the best for us right there we are oh there's the tiles we added last episode I forgot about them cannot lie uh, also we didn't show off the Uranosauruses last episode there's one there's another one of the Nigerosauruses uh, another Uranosaur and there should be one more and I just saw. Oh well. So, we need to add stuff here, but what we add is a mystery. Possibly, if we put a few more arches on the way down, 
we can add oh wait maybe we add like three arches going down if we go maybe like so maybe from here we can put in some of the light straws maybe in like a little petting zoo esque thing or just something that is like a medium sized herbivore that won't attempt to kill our guests and then another wall arch going down that way I can continue going on till here, and we have a wall's end crumbling there. There we are. And in this little habitat we got, we can put stuff in, which is decently obvious, I think. Uh, we can put maybe we can go with invisible fences from here, maybe. Oh, but that's going to go through. It's fine, we can just go round. As long as it can be covered, then it's okay. There we go. So that can be covered easily. Oh, we just missed a uh, go kill. Right, there we are. I got I panicked then but I then realized these were just individual individually placeable trees. Um so with the regards to what creature goes in here, it's still a mystery, right? Just something medium sized and something that is not like I wouldn't say dangerous but like a hazard. So nothing that because there's not really many aggressive herbivores in the game. Um, so something that is like, something that doesn't have spikes, right? Uh, hmm. A Sintel, uh, this is hard one. Notice all won't be bad. A guandon we've got. Uh, let's go with hib. Let's put hib voles on. Uh, I'm not gonna go with any like pack of the swords because they could just like theoretically bust down that wall. Um, so maybe Powers or Aloros. Maybe Alora Titans and Notices. That's not bad. I'll go with that. Let's make them social though. Even though it don't matter, but... Let's put some Notos. If we get three, three is fine. And then we can get all five Alora Titans then. Do I have all the skins for Alora Titan? Yeah, I do. Lovely. Alright then. Also, let's think of... A carnival that could have overrun uh, the power station. But what? Herreras, maybe? Oh, I've been having an idea lately actually of, if I go all the way to the bottom, of uh, Jurassic Park 3 Velociraptors. So, I was thinking Velociraptor 2001. If I get the. Obviously, this is the Quillian. And then we get one elf in there. There we are. Let's get our Nodosaurs in there. And our Allura Titan. Alpha. Boom. 
Alright, notices can go down. Oh, wait, no, wrong one. Uh, actually, let's cancel the notice all because we need to edit the enclosure first. Uh, let's put sand around there. Put some rock at the bottom of that. Uh, I feel like this needs to be covered, but by what? I don't know what I can cover it with. Uh, if you go up here, I want to put some more stuff on the road, see? Uh, uh, let's get a forklift. These ain't forklifts, these are cranes. Um, there we are. We can also... Let's go with one of these. Let's connect that onto this. There we are. Then you can go... Let's have a look what it looks like, actually. You see all the power stations, see some of the cranes, and then you just see the occasional velociraptor or two. Uh, let's go ahead with their feeders. Do we make them, do we make it look like it's an attraction? Or do we keep the feeders out of the way? Let's keep the feeders over here. Uh, where can I put that? There. And I guess one more can go... Surely that can go there. But that can go just up there then. Water. Hmm. Can put the water back there. Put some right there. Yeah, let's keep it like overgrown. Gives it a more. Makes it a more natural vibe, I would say. And uh, now we gotta add some foliage in here. Some ornamental shrubs. And let's put in our uh let's put in our rafters first. Let's get our one quillion uh, our alpha in there and then Wait, is it one, two, three, four, five? Ah, oh. all oh. right. Well, can you see the trucks in here? What's that over there? Is that just like the door to the other side? Huh, man, you can't even like. Wow, what's that? I don't even know. Right, anyway, is that William? Yep. That's the female. And now let's get all five regular raptors in there. Well, not regular ones, but you know what I mean. Alright, speed that all up. Fair as you know. Let's have a look at all our... I really like this one. Where's no name? Um, come on, show yourself. Oh, no name had really nice colours too. All the Atrociraptors have really nice patterns. I just realised how nice they are. Mr. Sniffer. And then there's Super Adagio. Alright then. Um... Do we go ahead with this part now? How long have we been recording for? We've been recording for 20 minutes, but some of this will be cut out anyway. Uh, yeah, I reckon we could. Uh, right, so let's just wait for some of these.
I really, I just realized I probably should have done like more, like some of these episodes in speed build so I can get a lot more done. Well, worrying about like a time limit. That's what I'll do for my next building series, hundred percent. Let's have a look at them rappers. Um. If I can get a shot of this one with some more rappers at the power stations, then I'll make a gr brilliant thumbnail shot. Alright, um. Right, is that it now? Yes. Alright, let's get the Nordosaurs in here. Might be a bit cramped for them, I've just realised. But it, it won't really matter. Some different rocks up in here. Oh, I really I cover these in rocks. Maybe that'll work. And then we can like make it look cool and stuff. I only really want this part to be covered anyway. Just so it's like not viewable at all. There we are, that's good. That's how I want it. Alright, anyway, now for the Allure Titans. Can you see that one? Oh, you can, so I'll have to cover that bit as well. Alright, let me go ahead with the rocks. Let's go ahead and put just all the same ones. Uh, actually, let's put just one different one in there. There we are. That looks decent. Alright then. Wait, are all the wraps in now? Yes, they are. I forgot how cool these ones look. Wait, is that. Is number one still the alpha? Yeah, number one still the yeah. alpha. Right, there we are. First of all, Titans in. That's a nice colour. Alright then. Uh, we'll just do this for that, uh, this episode, and then we'll focus on most of this in the next episode. Um, so, yeah. But I'll do it all in speed build throughout the next episodes, because, yeah, we need them. Uh, I might be bringing back my old enclosure speed builds because I haven't done one of them in ages and I feel like I've got better at the game as well. So I can't wait to do one of them for you guys. But yeah, uh, I think that will wrap it up for this episode. Um, this wasn't an action packed episode, I would say. Um, but like, it was alright. It was alright. Like, there's nothing special about it really, but pretty cool. Oh, that's a nice shot. Well, let's get you in front of this. Oh, what a shot. What a shot. Isn't that just... Oh, I like that. That's going to be the thumbnail, I think. Let's move that over a bit. There we are. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, subscribe. Comment what you want me to do next. I'm, uh, like, within Drastical Evolution 2, not just for this build. Um... So, yeah, just let me know what you want, because we need more ideas on this channel, because there's not very many. Cannot lie to you guys. Um, so, yeah, I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye.